Hello YouTubers, welcome back to Yorkshire Media. I am Mark, your host, your presenter, whatever you want me to be. And yes, I am cheaper and better than the BBC. Now, here on Yorkshire Media, we like to talk about TV series. TV series, what, what are different, I suppose. And this is no different as well. I'm talking, you know, about the series um, A Car Is Born or An MG Is Born. You know, talked about Mark Evans. Now, Mark Evans, as everybody knows, is a vet. He's a vet. He's a veterinary surgeon and things like that. And in his... Well, I don't know. Because he were on telly doing crusts and things like white vets do. Telling you the different breeds and what he doesn't like about certain breeds and things like that. And he came to Providence with a car that's born. He were going to build a kit car. And he got a TV crew involved who was interested in following this particular thing. So, so, you know, a kit car, you know, a kit, a, a, a kit car is born, sort of thing. So, AC Cobra at the time. And this is what he was making. His donor car would have fought Sierra and he, you know, building a chassis for the kit car, which would be a, 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 an AC Cobra at the time, which it was. And you know, and he was showing you what to do, and 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 the journey began. Uh, his journey began with with the born series. A, a car was born, and a bike was born, and a, pl a plane was born, and he's built a plane and things like. That. But the old journey started with a, with a car. You know, a car is born, and it was a kick car, and it was unrevealing that he. he he wanted to, you know, you know, see how many types of different transport, unique transport, he could build or find and things like that, or, or even restore. And that's what he did. He, he basically started with a car is born, a Jaguar is born, a, a, a 4x4, an MG is born, a bike is born, a, a trike is born, a helicopter was born, and a, a plane was born. And that's just some of them, you know what I mean? Look, quite a lot, actually, but... He did it, and he did, he just wanted to see, you know, different kinds of transport. The, but the way they filmed it, and the way they followed him, and that very, 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 very stylistic, and it all came about. And this all came about really before Wheeler Dealers, basically. Um, but Mark Evans is likes to restore things, and he, he like you know, because he's following his father's footsteps with engineer. Power was an engineer, and he wanted to follow in that footsteps. He became a vet, but he wanted to follow in, in that kind of in, in that kind of footsteps. And also, when you first saw him filming with the Carries Bomb, it was in a workshop, a very small workshop. But but that's where it was. And then he moved on to his own farm, where you know where him and his wife lived and. And that's where he built the airplane and the and the helicopter, in his own, in in his own home, his own barn, you know, a big barn and that, you know what I mean, and things like that. And same with bikes, I suppose, and things like that. You know what I mean? But he's not, you know, he, he didn't want to resell them or all that. Like he, he, he was, you know, he even did an American chopper, uh, a chopper wobble, you know, an American bike. He, he he's even done that. And it was quite interesting, and it and it's still interesting today. I mean, I've only got two of them here at, at this moment in time. I've got a, a V8 off-roader, which is a hundred inch. It's built on a Range Rover chassis with Land Rover Defender uh, Defender uh, 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 parts, basically. So he got a Range Rover chassis, and engine he kept the Range Rover engine with the Range Rover got the chassis cleaned up did what he had to do and got it all tattered up and then he started putting the Land Rover bulkhead because he was making a 100 inch Land Rover now a 100 inch Land Rover is very rare but they did it for the um, military and Swiss Army as well yeah and they do have one in the Land Rover Museum 100 inch but it's like an hybrid. You know, it's Range Rover engine, Range Rover chassis with Land Rover Defender, Defender 
um, um, bulkhead of wings and front as like what you see here you know he's over engineered that one but it's good how he's done it and things like that but yeah it's it is a good it is a good it is a good tv series it it, it really is and at the time there's nothing else like it on telly yes we've all seen americans building cats but for mark evans to come out and and do this particular one i thought it was quite good i really did and i really did enjoy watching him you know on my leisure I, I really did you know did really like him it it was really interesting and how to do it and i suppose if you follow the the, the video like I do in great detail, which I do, you know, I like to see what he's doing. You, it, it would inspire you to, to do it yourself, basically. And that, because there's nothing in any of these what's too complicated, really. You know what I mean? So, yeah, I, I did like that TV series. And I thought it was unique at the time, because I've never seen anything like it. Especially with Mark Evans. I knew who Mark Evans was right from the get-go even before he hit the TV screens, because I've seen him at, at Crush Stock Show and things like that. So I knew he were a veterinary surgeon. Um, what I didn't know, his father was an engineer, and, and that's why he's following in his father's footsteps. He's restored cars before, and things like this. But first, yeah, he did it on telly with a kit car. A car is born. He's done a race car is born. He's, he's, he's done all sorts of things, but he's doing the cars what he wants to do and he's doing different sorts of transport because that's what he wants to do so yeah that was a good one i think and, and when he came up with building his own helicopter and his in his own plane i thought oh this would be really and it is really interesting especially seeing the techniques what you've got to use to build these kind of things it's unbelievable it, it really is <laughs> really is unbelievable but he's also a bit of a joker as well he likes to have a bit of fun with his audience and that he likes to take yeah yeah have a bit of fun and that's what he does in these they are good i i really do and I, I really do enjoy watching car related tv shows especially this one as well as the wheeler dealers but this one i really do like us it's showing you how to build a car restore cars build an helicopter, build an airplane, restoring motorbikes, and how to build a trike. Yeah, I mean, really exciting stuff. It really is. So, if you like that, and you like me talking about that, please give me the thumbs up. So please like, like this. It, it, it does help if you do like, because it, 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 it helps the algorithm promote my channel. Also subscribe if you're new, hit the bell icon, hit all that will let you know when I'm uploading another video. Come back from time to time to make sure that you still subscribe because the YouTube algorithm has a nasty habit of unsubscribing people because it might think you're a robot. Also, please share the video. That's important as well. So you share the video to friends and your family and to other social media like Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Twitch and also use the comment section. Um, we can have a conversation about what you just seen, and I'll catch you on the next video. Bye for now. Catch you all later. Bye.